What's up guys, this is Soundwave Jordan here and we are back once again with some more gaming news. In today's gaming news we are going to be discussing Anthem. That's right guys, for those who do not know, I recently announced that I will be following Anthem as one of the games I will be following on my channel. Anthem was announced during E3 2017. It is Bioware's new IP and boy oh boy the game looks freaking awesome judging from the gameplay they showed us so far during Microsoft's press conference during E3 2017. And of course, as I mentioned before, I will be following this game, meaning that I will be giving you guys updates, news, and anything else regarding this game because, as I mentioned, it looks freaking awesome, it looks fantastic, and I'm really enjoying what they're offering to us so far. As you guys already know, Bioware, they have a decent track record, the Mass Effect Saga, Dragon Age, and of course, this new IP, Anthem, I'm pretty sure it's going to be just as good as the other IPs they've created in the past. So. Let's get on with it though, let's actually talk about today's news, as you guys can clearly see from the title of this article, the tone of Anthem's story will be very much like Star Wars, says Bioware, so, so of course I'm going to be reading this article and I'm going to give you guys some input and my thoughts on what this article may possibly mean in terms of the story being like Star Wars, so let's get on with it, let's actually read it right now. <clears throat> the tone of Anthem's story will be very much like Star Wars, says Bioware. Though we only know a few details about Bioware's upcoming shooter slash RPG Anthem, like that Mass Effect 1 and 2 lead writer Drew Carpenter is working on it, we at least know it's a sci-fi game. What we didn't know, however, was the kind of sci-fi it is. In a recent interview with Canada's CBC News, Bioware Edmonton General Manager Aaron Flynn mentioned the game would be science fantasy game, leaning away from the harder sci-fi of Mass Effect and more into the fantasy fantastical tone of other sci-fi stories. According to Flynn, the Anthem is very much like Star Wars, very much like the Marvel Universe, where you see lots of amazing things happening all at once. Mass Effect is more our real hardcore science fiction IP, Flynn said. This one is much more about just having fun in a game world that is lush and exotic and really sucks you in. Flynn also said much of the game's inspiration comes from the people who made it. We've had folks who've moved into Canada who are immigrants and so often those stories find their way within. Flint said we have LGBTQ members and those stories make their way into the game as well. So yeah, that's pretty much the summary of the article right here. Let's look at Game Informer's take. I think I prefer Mass Effect harder sci-fi in general, but I'm okay with the change of pace and Bioware can pull it off. So pretty much, I definitely agree with Game Informer. I usually prefer the harder sci-fi type of things, but if Bioware feels like they can actually pull it off, hey, go for it. Like I said to you guys, Bioware has a decent track record, and you know, they're known for making very awesome games, such as Dragon Age Inquisition, Mass Effect 2. You know, they just have a very decent track record, and of course, their idea ideas, their mindset, their passion for gaming in general, it's its blown us away before and I'm pretty sure they can definitely pull it off when they say they want Anthem to be like a fantasy sci-fi game similar to Star Wars and the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So I'm definitely all up for it. Um, I'm just very curious on how they're going to be pulling it off. You know, this game, if it's not going to be extremely sci-fi like Mass Effect, how else are they going to be showing us the fantasy aspect of the game? That is what I will be looking forward to in the future because, like Game Informer said earlier, there isn't much news regarding Anthem. And of course, the news of this game is going to be pretty light for a while. But anything that does come up, of course, I will be here giving you guys all the latest and greatest news regarding this game. So. What do you guys think about this in the comment section below? Please leave your thoughts down below because I would love to know what you guys think about this in terms of the game being more like Star Wars instead of it being a hardcore sci-fi shooter. Let me know in the comment section below because me personally, as I said, I would like it to be hardcore sci-fi. I love that genre of just games or movies, just anything along those lines, but they decided to make it a bit more fantasy like similar to Star Wars. So. What do you guys think about it? Do you guys want it to be this way? Do you guys prefer it to be hardcore sci-fi or do you guys prefer it to be fantasy sci-fi? Let me know in the comment section below. That's all I really have to say for today's video in terms of Anthem news. As I mentioned to you guys, I will be following this game and I will be giving you guys updates regarding everything of this game. With that being said though guys, that's all I really have to say for today's video. Once again, I will leave all links inside the description as well as I will leave my Twitter inside the description if you guys like to leave a follow on there as well. With that being said though guys, once again, this is Alvin Jordan here. Peace, late, and see you guys in the next Anthem video. I'm out to have a lovely, awesome, splendid day.